around 150 men of all ages came together to learn the ancient practice of taiaha and weaponry at a wānanga held on Makoya Island in Rotorua. The annual event began more than 40 years ago. It was established by Rangatira Mita Muhi with the aim of helping Māori men and boys reconnect to their culture. More than 40 years ago my father was working for an organisation back then called Māori Affairs. Māori Affairs were a sub-department of what was then social welfare, which turned into SIFS, which has now morphed into Oranga Tabariki. So it was always based around social services. So Wānanga was born of those kinds of um, concepts that he believed in, helping the culture, uh, helping our boys, males especially, because that was his field. Um, and so he started this Wānanga. And the Wānanga was based around Paiaha because he knew it was a way that our young men back then could connect positive, positively with, their, with themselves as Māori. Many of the students have now become tutors, passing on their knowledge to young and old. The key to our wānanga uh, is self-discipline. Self-discipline, self-pride and self-respect is what we teach through this traditional art form, uh, the mautaiaha. So the taiaha is a, uh, is a vehicle that carries all, I guess, all the hopes and the dreams and aspirations of our tūpuna. Um, and that our culture is handed down to the younger generation. Here you'll see our boys as young as six, six years old, five years old come across with their papa and they learn. Benefits from the island are about discipline, they're about positive cultural identity, they're about role modelling, they're about um, how to be a healthy male uh, in a healthy environment with healthy people. It's about keeping yourself sa safe, it's about all the great things that, um, that Māori are. Keel says his son has carried on the family tradition of teaching students on the island. Definitely a highlight for me is um, being able to bring my son here and uh, for him to share the same, same experiences, have the same experiences I had as a young boy and to see him now tutoring, tutoring young kids as well. Ensuring the sacred practice of Māori weaponry lives is hugely important with benefits throughout the community. Continue the work because we're probably living results of it. We all have um, a strong belief that our culture is our way forward. Um, working with others here on the island and seeing the progress that the young men make, um, it's, a definite, it's a definite positive and it's a definite truth for us here anyway. The Wānanga will be held again next January and all are welcome. Delilah Whaiteri, Local Focus.